So I sanded it and cleaned it up, uh, ready for primer and paint. I also reinforced the main rail right at the point, the pivot point. I just used a standard Rust-Oleum's uh, self-etching primer. It was a little bit windy out there, so I set up a little bit of a windbreak to help. Two cans of primer was just enough to do the whole thing. And we'll flip it over and put some paint on it. This is a Rust OEM high performance enamel. And those are the brackets for the bottom of the U-bolts for the axle. And this is the finished paint job. It's light gray. And those are the skids I painted blue. And the axle is U-bolted to the lower frame. Put those center clamps in there to help strengthen it because of the I'd cut it. And I did a little weld at the top right beside that bead, the bead right beside the U-bolt to keep it from sliding off. Here, put a little grease on the shim washers that's going to go in the middle. That's the finished. I put some some stops on there to stop the cradle from going too far. It's about 15 degrees. 
And this is with the fenders. These fenders are temporary. They're made out of the corrugated plastic. There's two layers of it. I'm going to get something a little heavier duty, but I was in a hurry and that's all I had. Had to transport a vehicle about 800 miles and didn't have a chance to test this. So we tested it on the road and it worked perfectly. There's a picture of our trip. 